Welcome back to the Carl and Ginger channel. I'm gonna do something different today. It occurred to me, I've got these saw blades as RC car tires. I can take the saw blades off and attach anything I want. I have a lot of interesting things in this car that are all going to become wheels on the RC car. Go. Oh. <laughs> Whoa! There's just three holes drilled through these modified tires that I have on here. And then there's three holes in the saw blades with these bolts. And if you haven't seen this video where I did the saw blade tires, you gotta go check that out. The front end on this got messed up in the last video. It totally went out. So I gotta take it into Cody's shop at Sky RC. And then I think I need to take the Ford Raptor in as well because we're getting some Roush performance upgrades in it. And that's gonna be cool too. I'll show you that as well. Oh, in the meantime, I've been messing around with a virtual reality 360 camera that I attached to Luke's mini bike and I drove it around and uh, while I'm working on this you can check that out. got a new helmet to match the new sticker kit on the ATV. I haven't even got to take it out for a ride yet, but I have a fun idea to challenge Ginger to a race up on some sand dunes. We might need to swap out the paddle tires or maybe we can load up and go to a totally different place. There's a whole bunch of riding trails around here where we live that are perfect for ATVs and dirt bikes and stuff like that. And we just finally got everything together. Got our quads all tuned up, our dirt bikes all tuned up and everything like that. We're just getting the stickers on, the registration, all this stuff. It's kind of complicated when you want to get into the outdoor stuff but we've got a really cool place that we want to try and go if we don't end up on the sand dunes we're going to go race these in another cool spot where it's just like motocross trails everywhere you guys might not know this but ginger's actually really fast on atvs and she'll probably beat me i got the custom saw blade rc car tires off and now i'm all ready to take it to the store to get fixed and uh we'll see what we can do next i just got done at sky rc i dropped off the erivo did something i probably shouldn't have if i'm not mistaken i think I just ordered the biggest, fastest RC truck that's ever been made that isn't gas powered. I think the electric ones are even way faster than the gas powered motorized ones anyways. So that'll be fun. We'll have to do some really cool experiments with that. Get used to that sound now. We're taking the Ford Raptor in right now to get a performance intake upgrade. It's supposed to improve the uh, intake, the power, the horsepower. I don't know, a bunch of stuff, but it's also supposed to improve the gas mileage somehow. I don't know how it can do both, like give it more power, but also improve the gas mileage. But Roush is a pretty awesome team and they've decided to hook us up with this package. So big shout out to you guys over at Roush. We're subscribed to your channel. Maybe you guys should go subscribe to him too. It's awesome, I love this truck. <laughs> I don't know if I could part ways with her. It's so beautiful. We've had so much fun together, but it's time. We're gonna be dropping it off here at uh, Ken Garf Ford here in St. George, Utah. Now they've got all sorts of Raptors on the showroom floor. They've got black, gray. They've got a whole bunch of them. Look, they've even got blue. There's Steve himself right there. What's up, dude? I got a call from Cody at Sky RC. He said that the E-Revo is done, so we can do the custom tires and wheels with all the crazy stuff on it. And also, it's time to reveal probably the best RC truck ever made. I'm about to show it to you right now because I just bought one. I got a Creighton 8S. Oh my gosh, look at this thing. This thing is a beast. I think the one that I got is actually red. So that's really cool. But I also want to get some other tires so I can do custom RC tires for that X-Max. And we can do the same thing with the bigger trucks. Oh yeah, this is the one. I think inside the box is actually this red, orange, and black one. And this is a really awesome RC truck. We'll have to unbox this and give it a test run in a future video. We'll compare this to the X-Max and you'll see the body on this and the way it's built. It's really amazing. I think this thing could probably pull a truck. I have a lot of interesting things in this car that are all going to become wheels on the RC car. I think first up, I think it would be really fun to try banana wheels. I've got four bananas, let's give it a shot. These might be the fastest drift wheels we've ever used. They might just slip all over the place. First up, we've got banana wheels. I've got all four tires replaced with real bananas for scale. I'm gonna go slow a little bit, and then I'm just gonna punch it and see if we can slip and slide on banana peels. It's gonna be awesome. And three, two, one, go. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> Whoa! There's still some peels. Still attached on there, flopping around on the back. What I didn't expect is for it to like 
pop wheelies. <laughs> I didn't expect that either. It totally just like flew apart. But at first, it kind of had some banana rock crawling action. Didn't you see that? It was that like That was clawing. so funny. That was really funny. But then when I hit the gas, everything just flew apart. It's like yeah. the revolutionary way to cut your banana. Those don't go together. They don't. What a shame. If we had a pet monkey, we'd have bananas to feed them. Carl, can I have one? You could have a pet monkey. Or we have all those bananas. So what are we going to do with them? So many birds around here. I bet they're gone by tomorrow. I had a guest at our Airbnb who was from Nevada, and they had like a mini monkey. She showed me a picture of it. It was like this cute little short. What? I don't want to interrupt your monkey story, but we have a chunk of bananas. <laughs> okay, that flew a mile. That's probably Whoa. at least 40 yards, I'd say, it flew from where we hit that's the That's crazy. So that's funny. Anyway, you can have monkeys if you live in Nevada, and that's like two minutes away. So basically it would work. And now we have to take them off. Look at this banana still connected. That's disgusting looking. Oh, gross. It's all like smushed. This is probably the one that I'm the most excited about. This is going to be awesome. Forget about it. It's going to so look cool. like a freaking rock crawler until... Until it doesn't. Until it doesn't. Right? I'm not going to give it away because I think have, I know what's going to happen. We have soda and Coke bottles. We have Coca-Cola and Pepsi as the front and rear tires. Uh, we just have to like... It looks so it's innocent, cool. but we know better, don't we? we do <laughs> All right, let's do this. Three, Three two, two, one, go. go. Okay. Whoa, whoa. Oh, it survived. Uh, they just kind of slipped out. I think a lot of the zip ties actually snapped under the yeah, pressure. Yeah, that was crazy. Look at this. Expected, but that one's actually just shook. It looks out. fine. It looks totally fine, right? Like... Okay, right by my phone, Carl. Uh, right by my freaking phone. We're missing one. We got one, two, three. We're all... missing a Coca Cola bottle. And there's, there's a Wait cap a right there. Do you see it? Whoa. <laughs> okay. It's right here. It's right <gasps> one right over here. Whoa. We might have to replay where that went. Okay, that didn't turn out the way I thought. <laughs> so, do we redo it or we move on? Uh, I say we move on. Okay. I thought we were going to have some exploding sodas everywhere, but it just kind of broke the zip ties. So on to the next one. Next up, we're going to attach these uh, gooey jitsu guys. They're like stretch Armstrong, like stretchy rubbery type characters. And we're going to see how they hold up. Change of plans. We only had three of these stretchy action figures that we put on the front wheels. So we decided to do these wubbles full of Orbeez on the back tires and I know what you're thinking and what they it look like. It looks just like marbles and sacks. That's right. That's exactly all it looks like. Okay, <laughs> well, we're gonna see what happens here. We've got everything all set up to go. And this time we've got a special treat. We're gonna send the airborne off a jump. Three, two, one, go. Look at this. Our toy bags of balls. Oh, my gosh. oh, shoot. Did this guy survive? Ah, he lost an arm. Uh, this guy's still on. The alien survived. This guy survived and this one's popped. Look at this. <laughs> oh, oh, there it went. There we go. That's what I was going for anyway. Ah. So this right here is the arm off of one of those stretchy toys. And this looks like taffy inside. It looks like magic putty, but it feels like saltwater taffy, like homemade taffy. It feels like we could do something cool with that. Oh yeah, that's really weird. Isn't that weird? It's like rainbow colored in there too. I swear, Carl, I just put that in my mouth and that is sugar. You put it in your mouth? That's freaking taffy. It's sweet. It feels and tastes like taffy without it's flavoring. Taffy, but it's with sugar. Like calorie chemical. <gasps> Don't eat that. No, yeah. I know. I just had to taste to see if it was sweet. Don't be dramatic. Mm. Now, listen, we can, I know how that. to make that. What could we make that could stretch? A giant one. That's it. A life-size stretchable Carl. For the last experiment, we're going to try footballs as RC car tires. First, I want to drive it around and see, will it drive? Send it off a jump. But then I want to see, because they're full of air, will it drive on the pool? That's a great question. On water, will it drive on I water? I mean, footballs are very buoyant. 
I think so too, but I don't know. That truck's pretty heavy. We'll have to go find out right now. All right, let's see what this thing can do. It might go better than ever. Check this out. Here we go. And the zip ties are just breaking everywhere. I just want to see for a second if we can drive it a little bit more. I'm going to go careful here before we take it over to the pool. <laughs> Those blue ones. Oh! It doesn't look too bad. We just need to have a more forgiving surface. All right, let's repair the other tire and see if we can get it to go on the swimming pool. Maybe the footballs will make it like paddles. Maybe the car will just make it like a boat anchor and sink it. Probably. Just kidding. Okay, I'm just going to set it on I the water. I have hope. All right. Oh. Quick, it's, Carl. I don't need to be quick. It's totally working. It's just Look at that. totally floating there. We have a floating RC car with football tires. That gives me so many good ideas for driving on water. How about you? Look at this. <gasps> oh my gosh. Here I go. Ready? Yeah, let's see it. Oh my gosh, that looks so cool. It's cute. It's really trying hard. Come on, RC car. <laughs> well, the faster I go, the more it wants to sink, that's for sure. Oh, oh, I see what it does. It's just doggy paddling. And the turning does nothing. No! Oh. It's really cool. Carl, though. I think we should take it out. Yeah, more or less. <laughs> Here we go, here we go. It can cross the pool. Oh my gosh. It's a success. Accidental success. Hello. Welcome to the other side. Check it out, it still works. I wonder now, what if I just drove it across? Here I go. Okay. Okay, I really don't want to take this guy back into the repair shop. He just got out of surgery, so I think that's it for this video, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching our video. That was so fun. This gives me a bunch of other ideas. We should definitely do a challenge where we try to do two different cars driving on water. Yeah, let's we do also it. I have, have the, some ideas. The flying RC car and a bunch of other cool stuff and the Creighton with all its tow capacity. With the ATVs and the new stickers, we have so many cool ideas. Let us know what else we should do down in the comments below. But if you like this video, click the other ones that you see on screen because we picked them just for you and we'll see you in the next one. Bye, Bye. guys. So cool. That was so cool.